I often wonder if Japan's sumo journalists, when short of things to write, start competing for who can coax the boldest statement from a top wrestler. Last week saw Terunofuji talk of Ozeki, only to be trumped by Asanoyama's half-concealed bid for Yokozuna. Presumably, the only way to top that was to have Takakesho vow to win the title for a second time, which he did on Monday. He was responding to a question of whether he viewed Shodai as a junior Ozeki, saying, At Ozeki level, you don't really have seniors and juniors. I don't feel a need to compare myself to others. All I'm thinking about is really wanting to win this title. He then walked back an inch or two, adding, At any rate, I've got to deliver a good result. I'll cast myself as the challenger and put everything into it. Asked about his final days of November preparation, he said, I always know how far to push myself, when to rest up, and let my fatigue subside. So I'll rest a bit, then build my body up a little more, and get through the week in a way that feels good for me. Takakesho for the title, anyone? It was two for the price of one at Chigano Uda Stable, with new Sekiwake Takano Sho also interviewed. Not only has he been training hard with Takakesho, but really working on his lower body strength, increasing his daily foot stamp count from 200 to 400. I got a right knee injury in Division 2 early last year, he explains, and unless I'm really strict on that part of the body, I might get the same kind of injury. He feels in fine condition now, though, and is looking to dispel any remaining fatigue by Sunday. Now, perhaps your country has debunked blood-type personality theory. Well, millions of Japanese haven't, and you can imagine the joy then when journalists discovered that Ho Shoryu, nephew of Asa Shoryu, is of type AB, the symbol of volatility. When he revealed this to stablemates, he was told, no surprise there. In his words, probably because I decide to do things on a whim, go to places on the spur of the moment without making reservations, that kind of thing. He soon tired of such questions, and stressed he'd never heard of blood type personality theory before moving to Japan at 15. A, B or otherwise, many Japanese assume him to have the exact same personality as his uncle, which is wildly untrue. Hoshoryu enjoyed another fruitful training session with hungry stablemates Meisei and Akua on Monday, with each man fighting around 30 times. Akua became the latest wrestler to be quizzed by journalists on the prospect of turning 30, in his case next week. Age is no issue, the top division newcomer replied. I'm not already 30, I'm only 30. He credits ex Yokozuna Haruma Fuji for inspiring that way of thinking. He watched me train when I was in Division 4 and pointed out various things, Akua recalls. Then, in 2017, while on tour, I suddenly met him in the elevator and was surprised to find he remembered me. And when I told him I was already 27, he replied, Ah, still only 27. Akua claims that sparks are flying every morning on the practice ring, with everyone in fine fettle, a sign of how fervently he wants to keep his Division 1 rank. Finally, we've had some new sumo recruits taken on. More on that when I actually snap their pictures at their grand mid-tournament unveiling. <laughs> 